Good evening and welcome to the Business Day. I'm Andrea Chisholm. St. Mary is to benefit from a multi-million dollar development being executed by Barita. The project, which will see the reorganization of the Reggae Beach, is to commence in 2023. Our business reporter Javon Keys has more. U.S.-based luxury airliner QCAS Aero, one of the newest carriers to commence service into St. Mary's Inn Fleming International Airport in Boscobel. As more airlines prepare to fly into Jamaica's third international airport, the prospects for the build-out of new business ventures in the surrounding areas flourish. Barita Investments is looking to tap into that potential with the purchase of the Reggae Beach and adjoining lands. The company is to establish a development there beginning next year. Robert Montague is the member of Parliament for St. Mary Western. What they are planning to do at Reggae Beach is to put in some 2,000 rooms, hotel rooms. But what they are, what is unique about their investment is that they are going to be spending some US $800 million over six years to build a new town. Manager of Investment Research at Barita, Awa Muirhead, says the development will have both commercial and residential offerings. On the tourism side, uh, we'll be looking at hotels and villas. On the residential side, we'll be providing housing units for those who are actually um, a part of <clears throat> the hotel, so hotel workers, um, villa workers, etc. And on the commercial side, we'll be providing to the wider community, so that involves uh, providing essential services such as police stations, such as um, hospitals potentially, uh, pharmacies, etc. The development should also include 250 homes for tourism workers. The North Coast Highway will also be realigned to facilitate the project. For the Business Day, I'm Javon Keyes. Recently listed microfinancing company Dollar Financial has forged a partnership with the solar system installers RTA Biz Energy Solutions. The collaboration will provide RTA Biz Energy Solutions clients with financing options to cover the cost of alternative energy solutions, including solar panels, solar water heaters, and generators. The expected, it is expected to provide easier access to funding and flexible payment choices. Dollar Financial will be offering the capital through a green energy loan. To the stock market now, the JSE index advanced by 2,365 points today, while the junior market index declined by 23 points. Among the winners, Siboney Group, AMG Packaging and Paper Company, Epley Carbon Property Fund, SCC, Palace Amusement and Access Financial Services. Decliners include JMMB Group 7.25%, Blue Power Group, ISP Finance Services, Epley and JFP. The U.S. currency is being sold for an average $151.98. $117.26 is the going rate for the Canadian dollar and $185.97 for the pound. It's costing an average $162.83 for the euro. And that's it for the Business Day. I'm Andrea Chisholm. Good evening.